In this video, we will see how Vern Bates claims that the loud cry of the third angel's message is not happening today because more events still need to transpire. He is purposely setting up the people to believe that the work of God is not happening today, that it is all still future. The message of truth has been given. We even understand fully the four angels message. Thus we are called to go proclaim the righteousness of Christ through this latter rain loud cry movement by mouth and by deeds to this world about our duty in obedience to the law of God. To claim that this work of God is, to be done, is not to be done today, but it is still future, is proof that Vern Bates and ministries connected to him like Nicholas Petula are purposely delaying the work of God and discouraging the people from doing it today. This type of work speaks in behalf of the Jesuit Order of Rome working and moving full steam ahead to deceive, to confuse, and to destroy those who would seek to want to do the work of God. They are being discouraged by these ministries. When you receive the message of the truth, when you understand what the Word of God is saying, like in the book of Revelation with the four angels' message, you are to not sit idle, but you are to get up and start working and not delay. Once you understand the message of truth, you are to live by it and go proclaim it and not wait. There are no more other events that need to happen to help you go do this. Go work now in the Lord's vineyard and he will give you the early and latter rain for these latter days. The early rain causes you to be converted to the truth. The latter rain that is happening in your life will help produce the fruits that the righteousness of Christ is working in your life. But in this video, you will see how Vern Bates purposely delays the righteousness of Christ. Uh, because they apply that Revelation 18 to the message of 1888. But I believe there's there's a lot deeper meaning to that than what, what we're understanding. But aren't there people, excuse me for interrupting your thoughts there, but aren't there people who say that that loud cry message is going on today? Yes, that's exactly what they're saying. Uh, but there are some events that we can measure so we can determine exactly, and let's, let's don't forget that thought, and as we go along we'll try to bring that up. Uh, there are some events that transpire so that we can know for sure when the loud cry message begins. Uh, so many, many people claim they are giving that loud cry message. In the Oregon Conference here, probably about 20 years ago, they started out one year where they finished work in four years. Well, that four has gone by five times, and this work is still not finished. In fact, I, I'm, I'm concerned today that the message is even going as well as it did 20 years ago. Isn't that discouraging? It's, yeah, it is. When, they, when, it, when it gets repeated over and over and over yeah. again.